I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. I've been doing this a long time, remember? While the Thalmor have been looking for me, I've been watching them. The Thalmor Ambassador, Elenwent, regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the Embassy, you can get away and find Elenwen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wynn's little party. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Malborn. Any questions? Don't worry about Malborn. He's not a dangerous character like you. But he hates the Thalmor at least as much as I do. He's a wood elf. The Thalmor wiped out his family back in Valenwood during one of their purges that we never hear about. Luckily, they don't know who he really is, or he wouldn't be serving drinks at the Ambassador's parties. Let me handle that. You'll have a real invitation, don't worry. As long as you can act the part of a Thalmor toady, you'll get past the guards. That's when the fun starts. You'll have to slip away from the party without raising the alarm. Then you'll need to find Ellen Wynn's office and search her files. Melbourne should be able to point you in the right direction. Sounds good. Be careful. Are you finished ogling the grotesque? I suppose I should be grateful you didn't simply attack me. I am one of the afflicted. I'd have been dead from this plague a year ago if not for Periite's protection. Returning to High Rock, our shepherd lost his way and I fear Periite's wrath may consume those who remain with him. Kesh could tell you more. I just want out of Skyrim as quickly as possible.
you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricker. If not, just keep your nose clean while you're here, or you'll end up like Rogbeer. You're just in time to say hello to Rogbeer. He's a sorry bastard who's going to be executed. A gate guard who let Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he killed the High King. Positions. As far as you need to go home. Go home and stay there until your mother comes. Traitor! Get on! Get off the it. city gate. You, you betrayed us! The is scum that betrayed his high king. Best she know now, Advar. All hard. Traitor! Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Turing. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't Traitor. deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric Liar. challenged Turing. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such is our way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords! Put him down! Very well, Rogvir. Bow your head. On this day, I go to Sovngarde. Some gate guard you were! He died well. I think I expected more. Good riddance to bad rubbish, I say. I'm a little busy at the moment. I've got all sorts of errands to run. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? They say the college has been snooping around Sarthor. Mages in a burial crypt? No good things you would ask. You might want to rethink that.
Huh. You know, you've got a certain fire in your eyes. Just like my... Some might call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Back to bits and pieces anytime. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Need something? Hmm? Really? You're who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Hello, I'm Gizli, but you can just call me Erica's sister. Everyone does. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Malborn smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. 
can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like that. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. Fellow latecomer to Ellen's little soiree. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, sir. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this godsforsaken mountain than to any desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early, often the day before the party, so as not to miss out on any of the drinking. There's not enough drinking in the world today, wouldn't you agree? 